Pisces, welcome to your May monthly reading. This is a collective reading, so it will not resonate with you all. If it doesn't resonate with you, I encourage you to check your sun, moon, and rising sign video on my channel as you may be sitting in that energy. Alternatively, you can also click the link in the description box below to my Instagram, Chelsea Therese, where I sell online personal readings all over the world through. Okay, Pisces, let's get into it. So the starting energy for you is the Four of Pentacles in reverse. <sighs> so there is an energy of someone being very possessive, very greedy, very um, controlling, very stingy, very their way or the highway. This person could be a feminine with the Empress, Empress energy, but does not have to be. They are just highly in their feminine energy because they're very dependent very smothering, nosy, up in your business, and they're just very um, toxic, really. They've got an energy of, like, they're not at peace, so they're searching and they're, you know, being very um, snoopy, going through people's phones, um, asking questions, just making them be around them constantly and being really, like, dependent upon your energy. In the middle of May, you're getting a very strong love offer. A male um, or a person in their masculine energy is coming in with a little lot of compassionate control. They're ready to put in the work to work for you. They see that you are very focused on money and work yourself right now. And they see that that's something that they would like to build and work with you. This person is a wealthy man or a wealthy woman. Um, but they are a very established person. They've got a lot of things going for them. And they see that you work very hard. But they're, they're a lot more abundant than you. And they're coming in to pretty much say, like, they want to help you out with life. They, they want to help you out with your career. They want to help you out with something. They want to love you. They want to smother you in love and money. And justice is here because it's finally something that you've manifested, finally something that you deserve. It's someone who is investing in you the way that you deserve to be invested in Pisces. Um, the truth is this person has so much love and abundance towards you. They um, really want to help you out. But this, for them to come in, you may need to let go of the smothering energy. In the hidden energy is you are looking into the future and feeling like you're not going to have any abundance. <laughs> you feel like you're going to lose your job. You feel like you're going to lose um, all your money. The truth is, this is anxiety. This will be playing in your head a lot, Pisces. Oh, if I lose this man, I'm not going to have another man. The other man is better. Or the other person, if you are a man and you're looking for a woman, the other person is way more abundant and way more aligned to you. That is the truth. The advice for you, Pisces, is that project, that person, that idea is waiting. Get after that shit. The world has your back. Dollars. Make it rain. Stop fucking whining. No one wants to listen to that shit. Complaining makes you weak. You have strength to change the world, so just do it. Be fucking grateful. Shit could be so much worse. And get the fuck outside. Move your ass. Your body is pissed at you. Okay. What somebody is thinking about you, Pisces, through the month of May, somebody who's energetically connected to you, it could be a loved one, a ex-loved one, a family member, a friend, but this is what they're thinking about you. I wish I had treated you better. I bury myself in work to forget you. I left before you could leave me. I hide behind material things. I look for you everywhere. I regret lying to you. I wish I had treated you better. I bury myself in work to forget you. I left before you could leave me. I hide behind material things. I look for you everywhere. I regret lying to you. 
And then on the end here, Pisces, we have your love and romance energy. And what's coming through for your love life is calling in your soulmate. Your prayers and affirmations and visualizations help bring you together. Past life relationship. You've known this person before. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Okay, Pisces, I hope you enjoyed this reading. If you have any questions, please feel free to click the link in the description box to my Instagram. Sending you guys love and light. Please like and subscribe as it really does help my channel. Thank you for watching.